Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here and I'm going to show y'all how to make another good rum drink. Now these are fresh blackberries that I just pulled out of the garden and I've sprayed them off with water and made sure there aren't any bugs on them. So I got blackberries. Uh, this right here I don't have fresh pineapples with me so I've got 100% pineapple juice and something that's important about this is it says sugars and zero added sugars. Obviously you're getting sugar from pineapple juice but you're not getting added sugar. So I got fresh blackberries, I got pineapple juice. I've got a good rum, again, not a sipping rum for most people, uh, but a high quality rum to, uh, to mix with. And, and this is uh, from St. Croix, so it's an authentic rum. Some of the cruising rums go really high end. This is just a good price point in my opinion. This is the aged rum, I like it a lot. So what I'm gonna do is get my little blender. You can find this blender linked within this video's description. I put some ice in here. Actually, first, before I put ice, I'm going to put a few uh, blackberries down here. It is worth mentioning blackberries will stain your lips and your and your teeth. So you know if you're going out on some sort of date or something, you probably uh, you probably don't want to drink this before you go because you're going to look like you're going to have uh, purple lips. So I put a little bit of blackberries in the bottom. I'm going to put some ice, put some more ice, and then I'm going to put some of this good stuff. Again, just put as much, you know, whatever your preference is. I'm doing a one and done, so I'm going to make it kind of strong. So there we go with that. Shake my pineapple juice, even though it's going to be blended. Still want to make sure I don't, whoa, Got stuff all over the place there. Put some pineapple juice in here. Mmm. And now we're gonna put some more. Uh, put some more ice. Again, how much ice you use is personal preference. That looks pretty good. Put a little bit of lemon juice in there. I don't have any fresh lemon or fresh limes. If I did, I'd use that. I just got this, this stuff. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of lemon in there. Not much. Screw the lid on. I love this little blender thing, man. Best part is you can just drink out of the thing. Check this out. So here we go. Whoa! <laughs> Look at that purple color. You got the purple with the fresh blackberry. Let it settle for a second there. Man, I love that. That's an awesome color drink. You drink this, you know, people will know you are sophisticated. They see that, they're like, man, that is a finely crafted drink. You are so sophisticated. And then to get fancy with it, just let that settle for a second. I'm going to take it over the sink so I don't drip. Don't want to drip on my nice floor, man. Don't want to drip. Uh, what I wish I'd had was some pineapple, uh, uh, bananas. Bananas always add you know, even more excitement to a drink with rum in it. So see now, look at that consistency. Again, consistency is king. If you want it thicker, obviously add more ice. But I like this because it's viscous. It flows easily. And to really class it up, you know, if you're serving this for, for somebody, you just put it in, put some uh, blackberries or stuff on in there and you can just bite into them. But, you know, obviously if you were serving it for somebody, you'd probably want to put it in a proper glass instead of this. But since I'm just serving myself, because I'm about to do a, a uh, YouTube live show, I'm just going to do it like that, man. Drink it out of the thing like a boss. Uh, tell me what you think within the comment section below. And be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash guy. Y'all have a good day. Hey, y'all. Captain guy here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash guy, And ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership, and y'all have a good day.